guys, if you're looking for Madden Ultimate Team coins at some of the cheapest prices on the market, make sure you check out my new sponsor, utnfl.com, and use code CLICKWID at checkout for a 5% discount. If you guys don't know, we're doing a pretty decent-sized uh, YouTuber uh, tournament. So we're going to have, like, you know, a lot of big YouTubers, uh, some smaller YouTubers, some mid-sized YouTubers. And basically what we're doing is just coming together to do collaborations. Um, the idea, essentially, is to figure out who the best player is out of all of us in the end. But honestly, it's more about collaboration and uh, bringing the communities together, getting people to, uh, you know, see what other guys are doing as far as content in the scene and things like that, especially some of these guys who are newer YouTubers are doing some really cool stuff. So, um, yeah, I mean, definitely go check out all those guys. In my videos that I do for this whole thing, I will have everybody's link to their channel in the description of my videos. So if you're watching this over on YouTube, it will be uh, on there, of course. Now, um, what's up, guys? Obviously, Nick Jr., Ryan, Berg, Tex, what's up, guys? So what I'm going to do is uh, I'll do my draft here in just a second. I Honestly, I don't know what all the playbooks are. I usually just use my um, my Texans or else my uh, Steelers playbooks. So hopefully I get one of them. If not, it could be a freaking disaster. I don't know. But uh, even if <laughs> – hopefully it's not. But uh, hopefully I get something decent. I don't know. But with that said, let's go into it. Play a friend. Do my draft. Oh, my gosh, dude. I have a feeling I'm just going to get some freaking ass in this draft. Here we go. Let's go, baby. Let's start it off strong. And we get uh, pretty much crap that I'm uncomfortable with, <laughs> to be honest. Titans might be okay. Uh, let's see here. I got to see if they have some of the formations that, I'm, that I know, at least. They don't have any of my defensive playbooks or any of the things that I'm used to. Let's see here. Shotgun. I pretty much run mostly out of shotgun. They do have shotgun bunch, which I'm okay with. Um, let's see here. Let's see what New Orleans has. I used New Orleans in the past a little bit. They have absolutely nothing that I like. Okay, that's great. Uh, Arizona. I know Arizona's playbook is, I think, what Ryan was running for a lot of the year. It has split close. I know that. Um, doesn't have bunch. It does have bunch halfback strong. But, uh, all right, so I think what I'm going to do is go with the Titans, I guess, just because that's probably the offensive playbook that I'm most comfortable with. And defensively, I mean, I can try and make it work. I don't think I'm going to have a shutdown defense either way. So we're going to go with the Titans. Hopefully they're decent. Uh, I don't know, man. What's up? What's up, Adam? Thanks for coming in, man. Berg, obviously, all you guys. Vision. So, all right, yeah, we're going to go with the Titans playbook. Sorry, Ryan. I don't know. I know you like the Arizona playbook, but Titans is glitchy, Adam says. I don't know. We'll see. All right, so we start off with our quarterbacks, and we got the GOAT, son. We got Tom F. and Brady. We got to go with Brady. I mean, come on. Tom Brady's the GOAT. Obviously, we're going with Tommy Smiles. All right, let's see what else we get here. Wide receivers, we get a Randy Moss. Let's go. All right, so I, I could either go Randy Moss or Ed McCaffrey, but I think I got to go Randy Moss. I mean, come on. It's Randy F. and Moss. We've got Tom Brady to Randy Moss, son. Tom Brady to Randy Moss. I don't know how, how you get much better than that. We definitely got to go with that. Okay. Now we start off with some ass. Here we go. <laughs> we get our offensive line rolling in here. Obviously, Theo Riddick is not going to be the running back for my team. Like, he just can't be. Um, I do have Jeremy Hill. I don't know if you guys can see. I'm trying to move aside here. So my running back right now is Jeremy Hill. Um, but, so obviously, I think... I'd rather honestly use Jeremy Hill than Theo Riddick. He's really not that much worse. So uh, we're going to go with Mason, or yeah, uh, Ramon, excuse me, Foster. And yeah, I don't know, man. Offensive line, I almost never like to draft it. But, you know, in this case, you kind of have to. Okay, so now we've got, uh, we got to go with Trey Wayans here, man. I know he's the lowest overall on the screen. But I really love the fact that he has 94 speed. I have Wayans this card. Uh, this year quite a few times, and he usually does really, really well for me. He's six foot tall, too, so he's not a little shrimp. So hopefully um, hopefully he'll be uh, a beast and shut down Mike Mack and those guys in the in the PlayStation side of the tournament, or I guess not even a side, PlayStation little portion of the tournament. All right, so now we got – we could go with an offensive lineman here. He's clearly the best player. It wants me to take the offensive lineman, but we're not going to do that. Like, what are you doing? Let's see here. Uh, Muhammad Sanu, he's okay. 89 overall. I mean, I could make use of Muhammad Sanu at least. 
I could go with Martellus Bennett, but man, is he slow at an 81 speed. That's really, really trash. Ah, uh, that's really tough. You know what, though? I think I am going to go with him just because I know he can catch the ball. So, yeah. Let's uh, let's do that. And I apologize again, guys, for it lagging. I Maybe at some point my stream will get fixed. I still have no idea why it does this every time I freaking draft. All right. So, uh, we've already drafted two wide receivers. So, Tim Brown's going to be kind of out, I think, here. Um, we already have an offensive lineman, one offensive lineman. We have a left guard. So, we could go with the right guard here with Jari Evans, or we could go with Andrew Whitworth. I think Andrew Whitworth's going to be the move because he does need to shut down um, the D end, at least, on those nickel blitz twos that I know are going to be coming. <laughs> so hopefully uh, hopefully he'll be able to do that. And we get an Anthony Barr here. He's definitely going to be the guy I go with here. I would, I would actually like to use this Robert Alford because he has decent speed too, um, as far as like what you get in draft champions anyway. Carlos Dunlop's too slow. But uh, Anthony Barr is like the user god, so we've got to go with him. He's got to be the man. Let's go. Okay. Next, we get a Trent Richardson, and we also get a Kenny. Um, see, I know what Ryan wants. He wants me to draft Kenny asshole Britt, but that isn't going to happen. Ben Jones would be obviously a good pick, but I'm not drafting a center because it's freaking Madden. So we're going to go with Trent Richardson. I guess Trent Richardson is going to be my running back. That is like the metaphor for my team, by the way. I'm telling you, like, <laughs> my team is going to be terrible. It's going to be funny. Um, so we get a Jake Ryan here, 88 speed at middle linebacker. That would be usable for sure. Um, I do already have an Anthony Barr, so I could use him. I think that I might go with a cornerback here, though. Malcolm Butler is pretty good. What, how many more rounds do I have here? You know what? I think I'm going to go with Jake Ryan. Just because I think I'll be able to get one more cornerback at some point in the draft. So I'm going to go with Jake Ryan just because he's got the 88 speed. And he would be really good if I'm not using Anthony Barr. So I think I'm going to go with Jake Ryan. So let's do that. Oh, man. I'm a little bit nervous right now. I Like, I'm drafting all these players. And I'm just like, I know people are watching me and going like, what an idiot. What an idiot. Why is he making that draft? Uh, Haha Clinton Dix would be good here. If I get Sam Acho, that would be three really good linebackers. Sam Acho would be the worst of the bunch at 92 overall as far as speed goes, but he's the best as far as attributes go. Uh, but I run a lot of nickel and dime, so I really don't actually have my linebackers on the field that often. So I think what I'm actually going to do is go with Haha Clinton Dix because I know he makes a lot of plays in the secondary for other people. So uh, let's go with him. Might be a bad decision. I think I couldn't have really made a bad pick there. I think all those guys are pretty damn good. Let's see here. Deshaun Shedd. He is probably going to be the pick here because defensive tackles ass. I've already got a decent middle linebacker and Lawrence Timmons 82 speed. So, uh, yeah, we're going to go with Shedd. All right. What do we got here? We get Coney. Could go with him. Could go with him. I know, like, he's not super fast, but he does have good attributes. Over well, no, he doesn't. 85 block shed? What the hell, Coney Ely? How are you not better than that? Maybe I'll go with Justin Houston and just put him at D-end. That might be the move. Yeah, that's going to be the move. I think we're going to put Justin Houston at D-end. Maybe not the best. But, uh, all right. Let's see here. All right, offensive line. We're we already got a left tackle, I think. Didn't I draft one earlier? Yeah, I drafted Andrew Whitworth. Denzel Perriman. You're too slow. 83 speed is terrible. For a defensive end, I could make this work, though. So we're going to go with Andre Branch. So, okay. So now we've got two defensive ends. So that's not bad. We've got a bunch of wide receivers. Or only actually a couple wide receivers, come to think of it. I did already draft Martellus Bennett, so we're not going to go with Cameron Brait, although I wish I had him instead. Uh, I do love Eric Decker, though. So we're going to go with Eric Decker here at 91 wide receiver. So we've got Randy Moss and Eric Decker on the outside. Six foot four, six foot three on the outside. Uh, we're also going to have um, some other decent players as far as like Martellus Bennett. But uh, I think that's about it, man. We got we to gotta get ourselves another big ass player here for the final round. Let's go. And we get an Amari Cooper. Oh, man. These are all really good picks. Amari Cooper, 97 overall. Sheesh. That could be a really ridiculous trio. If I have Amari Cooper, Randy Moss, and Eric Decker, or I could go with Dominique Rogers Cromartie, team of the year, so I would have three really good corners, or I could go with Patrick Peterson. I don't think Patrick Peterson's the move, though. I, I don't know. He's not quite fast enough because he's got 92 speed, 92 excel. That's not terrible, but it's not amazing either. Amari, it's, I think it's between Amari Cooper and Dominique Rogers Cromartie. What do you guys think? What do you guys think about this? What, what should I do? Amari Cooper, Dominic Rogers, Cromartie. You guys see I've got two corners already. I've got Shed 
and uh, Trey Wayans at, at corner. And I also have um, at, uh, at wide receiver, I've got Randy Moss and Eric Decker right now. So I think I might have to go with Amari Cooper. I think I got to go. I don't know. Xerxes, Nick Jr., you guys both say to go with DRC. Hmm. And Visionary says go to, with DRC. It's funny because he's the lowest overall of the bunch. You're probably right. I think I got to go with DRC. I think I got to go with DRC. All right, so we're going to go with DRC, and that is going to wrap up the draft. So you guys will see kind of what I end up with. Actually, not bad. 87 overall. I'm actually okay with that. That's actually pretty good, to be honest with you. I got some good-ass players, man. Definitely got some good-ass players. Let's look at this. Let's look at this again. We've got Tommy Smiles at quarterback. He's going to be throwing to Randy Moss, Eric Decker. I mean, that's not a bad duo there for sure. Martellus Bennett's a little slow, so I'm a little bit worried about that. And I don't really have great receivers aside from those guys either. Um, we've got an Alan Hearns here, which, you know, 84 speed is really not that good. Probably Corey Coleman's going to be the guy, honestly, that I slot in there at number three. Um, maybe, maybe Marcus Wheaton. Probably not, though. Probably going to be Corey Coleman. Um, we've got Trent Richardson at running back, which, granted, he's just a big old bum. But at the same time, his attributes are not bad. His attributes are not bad. So let's take a look at the defense then. Defensively, baby. Not a bad team here, I have to admit. I, I'm actually okay with this. So, I don't know why it decided to put... Man, what is this? What What are they doing? What? So, it wants me to have Anthony Barr as my backup middle linebacker. What What are you doing, EA? Like, what the, what the fuck are you doing? Honestly. I don't even... I have no words for this. So, that's not going to happen. Actually, it's because we've got a 3-4 defense, isn't it? That makes sense, actually, a little bit. But still... No, we're not doing that. Okay. So, uh, let's see here. Anthony Barr is going to play on the outside. Okay. Okay. It's just aiding me as usual. Let's see here. Yo, Wheels, don't hate. Don't hate because I got Tommy Smiles, okay? I know I know you want Tommy, and we all do. Who, who doesn't want Tom Brady? Let's be honest here. Uh, let's put this guy in as my backup middle linebacker. So, let's see here. Not backup, I guess. If I run much 3-4, which I probably won't, he's probably going to be, I guess, in the starting lineup. Justin Houston is going to be moving to defensive end. So, we'll put Anthony Barr here. This is probably going to lower my overall. I don't know. We'll see. But Justin Houston is going to play right end. Hopefully, he'll be really good there. Yeah, he's an 89, so that's certainly not bad. Yeah, we moved up to an 88. Dude, I got an 88 overall draft. That's, like, better than I get on Tuesday Night Draft Champions. This is crazy. I got a really good-ass draft. I can't even... There's no complaining from me. Like, I can't even complain that I got a shitty draft. Like, I got sh I got three good-ass corners. Like, pretty, pretty solid defense, man. Pretty much everywhere we're really good other than safety and interior defensive line. So, uh... And we got HaHa -Ha Clinton Dix on one side. It's just Branch is really not that good. Well, actually, he's... You know, 88 speed with six foot tall is not terrible for a gold. I mean, that, that certainly could be worse. So, Anthony Barr and Jake Ryan, though, in the middle. Those guys are both user beasts. So, I could send one of them on a blitz, user the other one, and then uh, we'll have good coverage on the outside with these cornerbacks. Got Justin Houston and Branch on the outside for uh, pass rushers. And then let's see here what we have for our return specialist. DRC. Okay. Yeah, 94 to that. Trainer Richardson as our third down back. So... There you have it, guys. My team moved up to an 88 overall. I'm pretty happy about that. Very good draft. Maybe the best overall draft of anybody, honestly, as far as overalls go. I could be wrong on that, but I think, I mean, it's definitely, nobody got an 89, I can't imagine, unless you did yours on Tuesday night, which you're a cheater if you did that. But uh, anyway, guys, that is going to do it for this. Hopefully, you guys didn't enjoy it. Hopefully, I didn't make any just monumental mistakes. Um, not real use, I'm not really used to using the Titans defense. So, um, or, or their offense, honestly. So hopefully I'm able to learn a little bit prior to my time that I play against Mike Mack, which should be later tonight. So, uh, I might live stream that, but based on the fact that this is so glitchy as it is right now, I probably won't be able to, unfortunately try and get it fixed eventually guys, but streaming just hasn't been on the, the agenda lately. So you know how it is, but thanks again guys. And I'll talk to y'all later. Thanks for stopping by.